factories use when it's available and not the map written air from option. And now we can see the print here in the list. <laughs> So I've had this printer for about two weeks now. I feel like I kind of got the hang of it. And I have some test prints of some stickers, which is the main use that I have for this printer. This one I printed out on cardstock. And this one is on sticker paper. The quality is a lot better on the sticker paper and it has the exact same settings on both. I don't know if you can really tell, but the sticker paper is a lot more vibrant. If you use this sticker paper, which is this one, I would suggest I would suggest laminating it because they scratch very easily. And if you do laminate it, this is what it'll look like. This is just glossy laminate. These are Kiss Cut stickers. I also made some prints on some semi-gloss photo paper. And this is what they turned out to look like. And then when I first got the printer, I was just printing on cardstock and I couldn't figure out why I couldn't get the colors to look good. But this is how it printed on cardstock paper. And this is how it printed on photo paper. The exact same settings, but the photo paper looks much better. So the kind of paper you print on matters a lot. And today I printed out a couple samples just for this video. And with these, I just played with the photo settings, not the printer settings. So this is how it came out without messing with the photo settings. This is how it looks when I bump the saturation to about 45 or 40% and the sharpness to 45%. So these are the difference between these two. And then I did the same thing for both of these. So this one is no tweaking and this one is higher saturation, higher sharpness. And I think, I think I like this one better for this picture, but I definitely like this one better for this print. But I haven't tried any real life photos yet. So right now I'm gonna print some real life photos and see how that turns out. So I'm on my computer right now and I'm just going to test print these two photos. I'm just going to print this out right on a 4x6 sheet of uh, photo paper, semi-gloss photo paper. So I always go to photo paper plus semi-gloss for anything and then best quality. So in here, I just have the mini sheets of photo paper. I'll show you which one I have. It takes a little bit of time to dry, so I'm not going to take it out yet. I'm just gonna wait a couple minutes. So this is what it looks like all dry. I think it turned out really good.
Now I'm just going to trim these. So I'm going to be sending these to my friend along with along with my mini Stray Kids stickers and one big chain bin sticker since he's her favorite. 